Well, lads, welcome back to the farm. Um, it's about eight o'clock in the morning now, um, and um, yeah, the fields, uh, the field agri is back, and the lime is still on the surface of the fields. And um, I think I can still fertilize the field. Oh, yeah, oh no, they're still there. Yeah, I think I can still fertilize the fields, and today is going to be a good day. There's going to be no rain till 9 o'clock this evening, so I could get slurry out in all the fields today. I think this is the perfect time to do it. Um, so I'm going to just see if I can, first of all. If I can't, then this video is going to be uh, very short and very funny to look at. But um, yeah, I'm going to go over to the other tractor over here and I'm going to... Actually, you don't need to yet. They don't need their bales this evening. I cleaned them up last night, but they're dirty again. Oh, over there. I don't know how to do it. Jesus Christ. I need to get straw into them, because I want to do manure as well. Because, you know, it's all saving money at the end of the day with manure. And slurry and all that. And to be honest, I want to get the slurry out, because the pit is filled with slurry. I can actually go on my phone and I can check all the um, things about the cows, including how much slurry is actually in the pit. So I'm going to go and do that right now for you. I'm going to see how much slurry is in the pit and then we're going to hopefully spread it today. And I'm happy that we can actually get it out now. So, um, let me just see. 24,000 litres there, that's quite a good bit. And um, the cows are, yeah, this one isn't going to, let me just check through them. That one isn't going to have a calf yet. Um, that one is, that one is, that one is, that, that one isn't. So all of them bar two are going to have a calf in a little over half a year. This one here is the closest. So half a year. Um, that would be 18. So that's. Yeah, that'd be in and around. Um, in and around mid spring. Those ones are going to have it, and then the rest will be late spring. So that's, that's good. Um, so yeah, we'll go and get the slurry out in this, these fields now. See what we can do. So the feed agri is back. It's the first time I've been in it since sending it into the shop. Gonna reverse up to it because I'd say this is the easiest way of doing it. So we're gonna be. Hooking up to this yoke for the first time since buying it months ago. It's very clean, isn't it? So, hang on. I already know how to use this thing, so I don't know if this slurry holds. This is a side note. Um, I don't know if this slurry hose will actually work with this because it's not really compatible but we're going to have a try anyway see what we can do um, let me just move out a bit there oh don't wait what No, stop. Right, so this... Does this attach here? I don't think it works. So we'll have to just throw this back into the shed. We'll just... We'll just do it manually. 
back and a refill see the gauge going up there it's very full there now let's start spreading slurry I forget how wide this is let me just get the the info page on the equipment up. It is. It doesn't say, it, does it? it? Doesn't say how wide it is. Okay. So um, yeah, I've got a lot of handy gadgets on my phone to help me. So go out to this field first because this is the first one. Oh, oh, caught something there. That wasn't that. Jeez, what's the catch? Must have caught the end of it. Oh, go on. Well, that isn't going to look too good. Scratch the poor old slurry tanker before we even started it up for the first time. Right. So we'll just, um, I'll start where I started with the lime up here. It's gonna work. This is good. Oh, and we're spreading the slurry here, lads. We're spreading poop. Um, this this is gonna be good now. I'm happy now. I'm happy that we're able to get this slurry out because these fields desperately need something now, and I need desperately need to get the pit emptied as well. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna empty the pit. Hopefully we're going to empty the pit. I'm, I'm going to spread slurry for some other lads as well, hopefully today, if we get this finished quickly, so. How quick is it going down? I don't know, can I tell? When I go around once, I'll have a look at my phone and I'll have a look and see how... spreading sorry I didn't think we'd be doing this today happy that we are it's gonna be great for fields that line was good for fields but now we've got the slurry on it as well these fields are going to be growing like mad next year Mighty Fiat Agri spread and slurry. Oh, can't drive in it. Kinda done that wrong there. See it's gonna be wet, so we'll have a little look at see and see what we've done so far. I have to drive up out of here though. I might have to drive through it. It's, the ground isn't wet, so it might not, it won't be too bad. But um, yeah, we're spreading slurry. Didn't think I'd be saying that today. Going through here. Heavy wellies wet there. I might go round the other way. I might just keep. Made of balls of this. Need to. Didn't think this out properly beforehand. Oh, yes, I need to check the fill rate. What? 
I'm going to increase that. I'm going to get more slurry out. Get up to 750. Didn't mean to turn on the light. Wait, no. Put it up too. Yeah. I'd know how well I done this now either. I didn't do that well anyway. It's a bit of a weird field to do anyway, so cut myself a bit of slack when it comes to comes to this, especially because I'm not used to the spreader either and the width of it and all that. And I don't really want to be driving in this slurry, so because that could easily lead to me getting the tractor stuck. That wouldn't be good now, getting the tractor stuck the day after getting the maintenance done on it. Yeah, I think today was a better time than yesterday to do slurry anyway, so... It's lucky we didn't have the tractor because we would have went ahead and done slurry yesterday. This won't, em this won't empty the pit, I don't think. These are very small fields, so a whole tank to a couple of fields there to drive in it. Jeez. Might have to do that sometimes, but I'll try and catch this bit up here. It's not wet though, the ground isn't that wet. I mean, it is now with slurry on it, but um, it shouldn't be too bad. Not too bad this field. That's a good, that's a good, a good turn in here. There's slurry going out in this field and I'm happy about it. Get slurry out in all the fields now. This is what you call a good day. No rain. Not too hot, not too cold. Slurry going out onto the meta. It's as vital to get it out now as in the springtime. Obviously, it'll do better in the spring, but um, the pit will be too full by spring and it'll be. Nightmares try and unload it all, so I think we can start just going back and forth here. And not be getting stuck there. Yeah. I mean the smell isn't nice but the but seeing it out in the field is nice. First bit of slurry spreading on the farm since it took over back in spring. And no slurry in the spring, so we couldn't, we just had to make do with the fertilizer pellets. We didn't have lime either. I could have done lime in the spring, but um, no worries, we got enough grass off the fields anyway for what we wanted. But we want to sell more grass next year, and we want to have more cows next year, so we need more, more grass to keep them going. So the fields need to be kept going as well, so 
The next field I want to buy is an arable field, so this is probably going to be the only grass fields we'll have for for the next year or two, or well, maybe more. But um, look, there's plaster of slurry on this field, and that's all that counts. Slurry isn't in the pit anymore; it's in the on the field. That bit. Did I miss any bits down here? Let's just get this little tiny. I don't know if I'm spreading enough out onto the field. I might have to put it up again because getting stuck. It's getting stuck. Oops, pulling on. It's a massive machine going through these little gaps. That's a whole field covered with slurry. It's what I like to see. So I'll bring you on for the next field and then my call quits and I might go, go and do the rest myself. Birds are at the field. Shoo! Go away! Get off my lovely um, grass that is covered with lime. Just see how much is gone. Right, I think we're gonna put us put this up to one. Yeah, that might be enough. We have to get that right, so we do. You have to get the amount right. Although we don't want to not have enough. You know what I mean. That much. Although maybe a thousand was doing all right because that was two thousand and half that field. No, leave it at that. That'll do. That'll do rightly. No. So we're spreading slurry on this field now. Last few days have been pretty good. Got lime out yesterday. We got getting slurry out today. It's all going well here on the farm. Besides the money problem that we have, but that won't be a problem now in a few months when we sell all the silage. Might pop down to Roberts later today and I might do a bit of slurry for him if there's much left in the tank. Hopefully there'll be a bit left. Might not be though. Might only have enough here for the fi for the fields somewhere. Like probably only will. Although the other two fields are quite small, so hopefully have enough on the for all the fields. If you don't then it'll be all right because it's not that not that big of a deal. It's getting the slurry out of the pit that's the biggest deal. By springtime there should be a lot of slurry in the pit. Hopefully about the same amount. A season and a half till then. I don't know if it'll be mid spring or um, I don't know when the 
see. It's very wet. Less time I spend in driving in the slurry, the better. How much is in it now? It's only done a thousand since, so I think this is the right amount. Still got over a tank load left in the ta in the pit. A little over a tank. So, uh, might not be close enough there. Didn't line myself up right. should be enough in the pit for all of my fields anyway. If there isn't, I'd actually be quite surprised. There has to be. If this tank isn't even half empty. I suppose though we spent the first little while. Um, going on a fairly low spray rate. Another thing I want to point out is I'm happy with all the positive feedback in the comments and everything on the videos. Um, yeah, it's good. I don't get many, many comments, but the comments I do get are always good comments. All the comments really helps motivate me to upload more videos on the series. So, so yeah, oh, that was badly. That was badly done there. Yeah, that pit um, it's been sitting there for over a day now I'd be thinking it'll be ready to upload by or oh, upload ready to open by um, late autumn and um, I don't think I will open it late autumn I think open it open it later is actually better for the prices 
and I think it'll keep me busy during the winter selling that. I won't sell it all in one go, I don't think. Although poss I might possibly do that because I yeah, I only have that trailer for a little while. Although I'm sure because of the, s the amount of signage I'll actually be selling, it shouldn't matter too much how long I'll keep the trailer. There's an hourly rate on it, and then there's the daily fees and stuff. And then obviously the base price for the lease of the machine in the first place. Gear's got a bit jammed there. Probably actually should have started at the bottom of the field because I'm going to have to drive up through the slurry. Should have made me way up the field. I'll know for next time anyway. I'll do that in the next field and start at the top up there and I'll make me way down. Doing a good job here. This be it agri on this the slurry spreader. Although you'd expect it. Expect the mighty Fiat Agri to, to do well with this machine on it. 180 horsepower remember this tractor. Yeah, it definitely costs less to be doing slurry spreading over fertilising as well because fertilising is expensive in the long run. Just a little bit there missed. Um, so yeah, that's that field done pretty much. And um, yeah, if there's anything you think I should do with the farm, anything that might help with developing the farm, then leave a comment or whatever. If you don't have anything, then just... I don't know, just don't do nothing, I guess. Did I get some of I think I did. Can't really see, but I think I did. Chance to leave. Doesn't look like there's there anyway. So I'm going to move on to the next field. Two smaller fields. I'm going to finish them up, and I'm going to... I might see what Robert's at and I might see if I have enough slurry left in the tank to do it. I have. You know, I think I should put that spray rate up again. Put it up to this. This much. This rate I should definitely have enough to spread another field. Spread Robert's field. So yeah, that's the, this field done, that field, 
I'll go and do the rest of the fields. It's a nice sight. So, anyway, I'll talk to you soon. Good luck, lads. <laughs>